Hello everybody. How are you? Today uh, I'm going to talk about another homemade weapon that I'm working on. And a, a detail that I found trying to do another thing. Another uh, thing, another weapon. So we have here, I was trying to do uh, another shotgun, but with a trigger, uh, a, a trigger and a handle. This, this is not finished, this project, and I'm, I've been working on it, but I stopped. Tell you why I stop in a, in a minute. But here are the pieces. Uh, here we have a striker uh, string. So it's, it's on, on pieces here. I'm gonna put it together quick and so you can see what I'm trying to do. So here we have this one inch pipe with a cut here, another cut here, okay, we're going to put this striker and string in there. So here we have it, it got a screw, so I can screw this on the striker. And it has a stop here. Uh, this screw is for a stop for the striking pin or the bore to stop in before the striker here. And that temp, my attempt was this, that this worked with a trigger. And you charge here. You put your shell inside like a slam fire shotgun and assemble it and fire. I was working on this and it didn't work. Uh, before I continued working, I, I tested it tested the, the striker with not a live shell but with primers on empty shells and this spring and striker mechanism didn't didn't work didn't ignite the stri uh, the striker on the shell so I stopped working on it uh, I think, I don't know why exactly, but I, I have the idea that, that this piece is too heavy and doesn't get enough velocity to hit the, the shell, the, the striker, the primer, and so I'm not sure. So trying to to make it work, I, I thought, well, maybe it doesn't uh, ignite this prime, but maybe it can start a 38 special. Here I got two shells, different shells of 38 special, and I thought maybe it work on, on these ones. So, and that's what I want to show mostly in this video, is how to make a 12 gauge uh, bore into a 38 uh, bore. 
So how do I do it? If you see here, I inserted inside a three quarter inch pipe a piece of this half an inch pipe about seven centimeters maybe seven centimeters I had to mill it and it went by hammer inside this board inside the three quarter pipe and then I got this piece made of this bronze this is a bronze made of uh, not exactly it's uh, like this one it's a smaller one but it was like this one it had it had threaded it was threaded on this side and it had another piece on the other so I milled it and I cut one side of the bronze part and it matches exactly you can see here a 38 cartridge, a 38 special cartridge. I hit, this one is a pellet one and here is a standard one. You have to push it and it goes inside. So this adapter then comes in here. You push it in here and there you go. You have now a 38 uh, caliber adapter to a shot shell adapter. So I tried it. Let me get it out. I tried it the same experiment with this adapter it's a little hard to get out okay with this adapter if you see here I made some cuts here in order to extract the the case after shooting I tried it with the bullet with the 38s and the spring and the, and the striker like I show at the beginning, and it didn't work. <laughs> it, it, it didn't work. So we got the. I didn't fix it, but but I I use it. I I I tried it like a slam fire with the 38 cartridge, just. Fixing here the striker and and putting the um, adapter here. I'm not gonna put the the case now. You put the 38 special here, and I tried it like this, like a slam fire, like a standard slam fire, like this, and it shot very well. Uh, it shot well. It was a little hard here. We have the ten cases. If you see that a little messed up, it, it was hard to get it out from the from the adapter after the shooting, but it worked pretty well. So that's mostly what I wanted to show here is that you can make a. <clears throat> 38 uh, caliber slam fire or trigger fire with pipes. In this case, pipes like this, like a slam fire, a one inch pipe, a three quarter inch pipe, and a half an inch pipe inserted in the three quarter, not too long, and a brown setup. So, well, I'll keep on trying to 
to make this work with the trigger and the handle and the pressure measure. If you want to see some live shooting of the 38, like a slam fire, let me know in the comments. Well, that's all for today. Ciao.